give you a quick seven o'clock. It is Monday, January 4th, 2021. Call the order of the meeting of the Brookfield Planning Board. This is a work session, so we're focused on our Warren articles. Um, I'm Tim Stratus, Terry Ward. Here. John Mayer. Here. Ed Camo. I'm here. Rick Surratt. Present. We're all here. So, uh, final review of the proposed Warren Articles, Amendment Number One and Number Two. We already approved these at our last meeting, but I put it on the agenda just as uh, just so everybody. Well, we were going to sign them off an email, so it was we all know read the email. We know what they're going to be. Right, Number One and Number Two. So yeah, essentially this for now is what I emailed you guys uh, last week. Yep. So I think we've already voted, we're all in agreement on this, so I just wanted to... I, I will we accept them as written. Second. Discussion? All those in favor? Aye. 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 Opposed? All right. And I vote, again, the vote was just to uh, say the language is acceptable. Yep. Uh, the next item discuss proposed amendment number three, rec one subdivision. This is our discussion. Uh, went to the lawyer and we asked about our previous was that we were, our, our proposed amendment was a recreational lot shall not be subdivided. To which the lawyer expressed that that would be a very difficult thing to. Uh, Enforce. enforce and uphold. So her feeling was that if you were going to uh, make a change, you would increase the size of the lot, not decrease or eliminate it. Increase. Sorry, Mr. Chairman. Yes. So increase the the subdividable lot within the rec zone. Yes. And she referenced that the town of Hanover has a forestry and recreation district where they have a 50 acre minimum. Um, with all the setbacks and the road frontage and all of that. So that's the other direction we can go, or we could just take this off the building. Currently it's what, 10 acres? It is 10 acres, so it would stay that way, two acres everywhere else in town. Considering the, um, the lack of road frontage and the lack of buildable land in there, but that might be a good idea at this time to just leave it as is. So if you would accept a motion, I would motion to um, remove this from our list of applicable yep. uh, items. Sure. Articles. Second. Good second. Any discussion? All those in favor say aye. 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 Opposed? <coughs> it is removed. Uh, um, that's all the business for today. It's 7.03, the meeting is adjourned. Can, can I ask one question with regard to that? Because if you were at zone, it would be this one, right? Yes. Yeah. How many acres is that? 200 and some odd acres, I think. 230 or 280. Yep. Somewhere in there. Yep. Is that, is that the front and then down the back, or is that... What you see on the front, and uh, it goes off to the side a little bit too. Up, up to the, way up to the top, the top, not the top of the ski area. Yeah. And he's on. Goes beyond that. So, Mr. Chairman, just to recap, we're actually going to have a, a, a coming, upcoming public hearing yes. on January 11th. Yes. And it will be for these two. Yep. Just so the public hears it again. Yep. Even though you adjourned. Let's try to get it at 7.04.